What's going on guys? My name's Parth and welcome back to more Dragon Ball Z Universe 2. In the previous episode, we finished off the Majin Buu saga and we also finished the Beerus saga all in one episode. And now in today's episode, we'll be starting the Resurrection of Frieza saga. Before we jump straight into the Resurrection of Frieza saga, in the previous episode, I was a bit under leveled because I was like around level 50s, but I'm not sure if that was the actual level requirement to do the Majin Buu saga, but it's whatever. I was like, how about this? I do all the parallel quests just to be up to par with the levels and now I am at level 73. And if we take a look at my skill set over here for good old Parquisha, I replaced Split Finger Shot with Burst Kamehameha. I didn't really change much because I only changed like two things. And as you can see, guys, whoo, I have Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan. I have acquired this form. But anyways, I was like, you know what? How about this? Since we are entering in the Resurrection of Frieza Saga, if you guys never watched the movie or watched the arc from Dragon Ball Super, Goku and Vegeta go Super Saiyan Blue for the very first time in those two, well, in the movie and in the arc for Dragon Ball Super and of course in, in this game too so without further ado guys let's jump straight into the resurrection of frieza saga all right let's see what's popping now so we now know that frieza is back with a new form golden frieza uh not gonna lie i don't i mean even though it's the same thing because when they did the golden frieza saga in the dragon ball super anime i feel like the movie did it better I, I don't know, it just felt more exciting because the first two arcs that they showed in the Dragon Ball Super anime, it felt like filler right there. It, ju it just felt so unnecessary, but at the same time, it's whatever. We were bound to watch it either way. It doesn't even matter because the first arc was with Beerus, even though they had a God of Destruction movie already. And then the second arc, which I, as I mentioned, which is the Golden Frieza one. So, uh, yeah, that is very interesting it's just like i don't i don't even the animation that they did in the uh beerus arc in in the dragon ball super anime oh god the animation was just cut awful it was you would literally just go on twitter and just see so many memes just from the god of destruction uh saga from the dragon ball super anime not from the movie the movie did it really good like oh my gosh i won't let you destroy my world okay so, so intentions Toa's intention can't be good. Okay, so we're figuring out what is Mira and Toa's intentions. But uh, from the looks of it, Toa is gaining so much power. Does that mean... Uh, no, 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 not Toa. Toa is the the girl. Mira is the guy. Okay, I, I got that mixed up. Why can't it be Mira as in the as in the girl and then Toa as the guy? Like, come on, man. But it's, I mean, it's whatever. Let Dimps do whatever he wants. Okay, so since Mira is gaining so much power, I'm I'm expecting a new form from him. But then again, I already know I played this game like four, five, possibly six times because I do have other characters that I played with. I made well the first saying there's like a I have a Frieza character, I have an Earthling character, and then a Majin character. So I think this is my fifth or sixth time playing this game. I'm gonna have to look back at it. All right, so let's just skip all this part. Okay, come on, let's just go to time traveling. Let's just go on our time patrol. Go save the universe once again because I am the legendary female Saiyan Parquisha over here. Come on, man. All right, okay, Frieza again. Okay, cool. There we go. Now they're catching on. Frieza is back. The almighty Lord Frieza, the Emperor. The one that destroyed planet Vegeta. Or, yeah, planet Vegeta. There we go. Okay, come on. Let's just, we're just going to have to skip all this part. Come on. Is he really that much stronger? Yes, he is. He, he has acquired a golden form. Oh, boy. Okay. Oh jeez, I'm already getting my butt whooped. Alright, so we gotta take out 15 of Frieza's little soldiers over okay. here. Let's just, I wanna see how much damage I can do now. Or, oh god. Okay. Oh my god, that's a lot of damage. Well, actually, no, these are just Frieza's henchmen, so that doesn't, that doesn't count. Let's, let's just wait until we actually fight Frieza. But anyways, hope you guys are having a great day. If you are new to the channel, what are you doing? Drop a like on this video, comment, subscribe, hit, the, smash the heck out of that subscribe button and if you guys want to 
I'm not, I don't really force things upon people. You can always share this video with friends or family. I try to keep it family friendly on this channel. Sometimes I do, sometimes I do, or so, sometimes I don't. It's just a 50-50, it just depends. Okay, let's, let's actually take this seriously and not keep getting pushed away just by little henchmen over here. Okay, can you stop running away? I know you want to <laughs> stop running away. It's not going to help you. Okay, what is going on, bro? I swear, off screen, I was just flying through these parallel quests, knowing what I was doing uh, with the stamina breaks and the, using the ultimate, ultimate attacks on time. Okay, wow. So you're going to push me away too? You know what? Okay, you know what? Supernova cooler. It's, it's not like these henchmen can actually freaking uh, stamina break me. Anyways, there we go. How are you attacking me? But Dim's fix your game, bro. I mean, I know this game has been out for like four years now. That's crazy that this game has been out for four years, man. It still doesn't... I don't know. It still, it still doesn't feel like it's been four years since this game came out. But hey, that's just me, though. It's unbelievable because, like, I know this game has had, like, a lot of issues, even with the netcode. Netcode as in, like, online issues. Oh, man. People people that have played Xenoverse 2 actually know the struggle of the netcode issue <laughs> that people have been having having problems with this game. Alright. Okay. Come on. And not gonna lie. Okay, so I don't know if I mentioned this in one of my episodes throughout this whole entire series. But uh, I remember in Xenoverse 1, when you would go into the Super Saiyan 1 transformation, your key bar would go down. I was like, bro, that's so stupid. And what made it like so broken is that um, you were able to spam the hell out of your freaking ultimate attack, like nonstop. At like while you're still in that tra uh, Super Saiyan transformation, uh, you could just um, spam your ultimate attack nonstop. Uh, okay, wow. Come on. It's a good thing that I'm up to par with the levels. I'm level 73. Okay. Okay, I, f I forgot to teleport. Did I just forget how to play this game? Come on. Well, I'm pretty sure... I think the last time I was playing this game... Oh my god! Can you not? Supernova Cooler. Just take this. Just take this. Just take it all. Jesus, man. Can you stop shooting key last time? Oh my god, yo. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Stop shooting key blast. This is like one of those grab spammers that you see on Mortal Kombat. Oh my god. Like in Mortal in Mortal Kombat 11. Oh my gosh. No. Not even Mortal Kombat. Like in um I don't remember the last time I was playing uh Tekken 7. But uh oh my god. You have no idea. I ran into this one person that I was playing up against in a ranked match in Tek uh Tekken 7, right? And guess what? This dude was literally spamming the grab button. That's literally like me when I'm playing Smash Bros with my boys and spamming the the spamming the B button with Pikachu, bro. Y you think me spamming the B button in Sma Smash Bros is worse? Yeah, try playing Tekken 7. Oh my god, Tekken 7 with uh, spam grabbers? Like uh, grab spam people? Yeah, dude, uh -uh. You, do not need to, you do not need to be playing this game and take that somewhere else. You can grab somebody... <laughs> and a different game but just not in Tekken 7 you can do that in Mortal Kombat or 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 better better uh this is better do that in freaking Smash Bros because you can actually do combos with grabs like come on man like I'm glad that I know how to actually play Tekken 7 I'm, I'm still learning though I, I'm not saying that I'm I'm good at it but <sighs> Alright, Frieza has shown himself. Okay, wow, I'm on low health. This is not good. But hey, okay, why'd I just... I forgot to stack up on capsules. Wow, I'm an idiot. Okay, let's let's just actually heal up like an actual smart person. Nope. Nope, you are not gonna do that. Okay, cool. So yeah, as I was saying, if you're going to play a fighting game and you're gonna spam the grab button... Yeah, um, I'm not gonna allow that. I'm gonna make sure <laughs> that I'm I'm gonna I'm literally going to 100% make sure that I'm not going to like do that at all. Spam grabbing is not allowed. You could do that in Smash Bros. or just any other game that actually allows you to do combos with grabbing. But that's it. Not in Tekken 7. Not in Mortal Kombat. Well, actually, well, see, 
I don't mind grabbing, but don't spam it because I mean it does it does good damage in Tekken 7 and and in uh, Mortal Kombat. But uh, I gotta stay up to date with Mortal Kombat 11 because I know they have that DLC, and I really want that so bad. The Mortal Kombat 11 DLC with uh, I believe Shang Tsung, Shang Tsung and two other people. So that's what I really really want. The DLC so I can actually play that on screen when I get the chance to do a Mortal Kombat 11 let's play. So uh, yeah, stay tuned for that because there is I believe Man of Medan, Fire Emblem Three Houses, and then I believe two or three other games. But I'm not going to spoil it because I know how I act, or I know how I know how I am, and you goes and you guys know how I am too. And um, yeah, I just don't want to spoil the the two or three other games that I want to let's play on this channel. So all I could say is stay tuned. Oh boy, the Golden Frieza has shown himself his true power. Okay, you know what? Oh, oh wait, oh, come on. So, oh come on. Uh, it isn't over yet. You can't beat me, I'm Goku. <laughs> he does that like little weird laugh whenever you play as Goku. Like, you can't beat me. Or, hi, I'm Goku. <laughs> he, does, he does some type of laugh. Or like when you choose him as a character that you, that you want to choose as and like... To play with so you can fight against others or do a parallel quest or something you know what i'm gonna show my true power i'm gonna show my true power get ready frieza i'm gonna go super saiyan blue let's go yeah man i totally didn't do the tingly back sensation that the universe six saiyans did oh uh, I, got, I gotta make sure i gotta i gotta remind myself that when you're in when you're in the super saiyan blue and the super saiyan evolution form uh, your key bar goes down. All you gotta do is just keep charging up. That's literally it. That's all you gotta do. Alright, cool, cool. I'm doing a lot of- Oh my god, yo, I- Frieza is getting demolished. <laughs> you noticed me? This planet's Dragon Balls can grant two wishes. So, guess who's back? It's Kula! <laughs> Let's go! Two Super Saiyan Blues? Okay, you know what? You know what? Alright. Metal Cooler is back. Okay. Wow. He's, he's just a... He's just a robot. The Big Getty Star. Okay. Alright, nice, nice. You're, but you're not going to beat me, though. Alright, you're not going to beat me, though. I'm Parquisha. I'm the legendary female Saiyan. I'm better than Brawly. I'm better than Jiren. I'm better than freaking, um... Goku over here. I, I bet I can beat him in his Master Ultra Instinct form. Oh my god, wow. Yo, Goku took a lot of freaking damage. Okay, what do you want, Frieza? Get out of my way. I, I get that you're the Emperor. The, the Emperor. Wow, I, I mispronounced Emperor. Oh god, no! Yo! Chill! Oh, you got. I can't believe I got stuck in that. I can't believe I got stuck in that. Wow. I, I managed to fail at the stamina break with Metal Cooler Super, Supernova Cooler move, or while he was doing that ultimate ultimate attack, and I can't believe that I managed to fail at doing a stamina break with uh, Golden Frieza over here when he was using his little Death Beam. Wow! All right, so all we gotta do is take out Metal Cooler, and we're all set, boys. Let's go. Jeez! Oh my God! I'm doing a lot. Of Nope, I'm not gonna allow you to do that. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Yo, Goku, this is this is Goku, this is my fight. Uh-uh. I'm sick and tired of these little peep um I'm sick and tired of these villains. Or or as I would I guess call them the League of Villains. I don't, it's because I was uh catching up on My Hero Academia on season four, because I was behind. Like I was still on season four when when it first came well when season four came out, I was still on that season. I was on, I was like on the very beginning, and I was I'm finally catching up. And by the time this video goes up, I'm going to be done with My Hero uh, Academia season four. So I'm very excited for that. I'm very excited because 
I really don't want to be behind on My Hero Academia because it was getting it's getting so good, man. It's getting so good, and I and I heard the manga is getting really good too, but I I don't really know much on the manga. I I'm not really uh, reading the manga right now. I wish I I wish I am right now, but I'm just so used to just watching the anime. So whenever season five comes out for My Hero Academia, I'm ready. I am freaking ready. But uh, yeah. I'm, I'm super excited for a season 5 for My Hero Academia. Wow, I got a D rank. Oh god, that is so terrible. Oh god. Alright, so thank you guys for watching today's episode of Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2. I had to cut it a little bit short because I didn't want to finish the whole entire saga in one episode and just have you guys watch like a very longer video. But because uh, I know in the previous episode we finished off two sagas and that was like almost 30 minutes. I tried to make it short, but I mean, eh, it didn't work out at the end. But hey, it worked out just somewhat but anyways guys smash that like button to 15 more likes and as always guys have a fantastic day Thank you.